What's up guys, Prime Blast here and welcome back to another Bit Wars video. Today we got ourselves a brand new update and this update they added a new uh, kit to the battle pass which is a smoke kit. You can get this battle pass when you're level 25. So today I'm going to be showing you everything about this kit including its abilities and also it, its weaknesses. So before I start, please remember to smash the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell if you want to watch more videos like this. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so if you go press the patch note, you can see that there's all the information that you will need for this kit. So I'm just going to read a few of them. So you can buy a smoke bomb to temporarily disappear from sight. So this is basically like the invisible pot. You can just drink it and you have an amount of time where you are invisible. So for this smoke kit, you can only go invisible for 9 seconds. But the smoke kit's only weakness is that you can't interact with the map. So if you have the smoke kit, you can also buy a smoke box from the shop so that you can obscure your location. So the smoke blocks, you can go through and walk through the blocks, you can shoot through them, but no one can see through it. So it's basically like an invisible block, so I'm not sure. So let's quickly get into a custom game, I'm gonna show you these two items that was recently added. Alright guys, so here we are in the custom game. So the first item that I'm gonna show you is the smoke bomb. So for this, you can unfortunately you can only buy one as you can see. And if you eat it, it's gonna act like an invisible pot. And I think you can just go around and no one will see you. But I'm not sure about the the stuff at on top of your character. I don't know if other your enemies or your other players can see that. So if the top like the top part no one can see that then you're completely invisible but the only thing that you need to be aware of is the the steps like the your i think steps i don't know what you call it it's like those white part that will be following you when you're walking so this will in give your enemies like a bit hint of where you are so the next item that i'm gonna show you is the smoke block so you can just place it all around your your base if you want. So basically you can just go through it and I think the reason they added this block is so that you can hide in it. I'm not sure. So if you're in like a, a hundred players map, you can just buy a bunch of these and just hide in like a corner or the bottom of the map and no one will find you. Or the other way is you can just put the block uh, place it all around your base and they are gonna have a hard time finding you As you can see I'm completely invisible you can say that because I'm in the block So if you buy a bow Over here and if you shoot through them I think you can sh shoot through them as you can see right here and so you can just build like a a hallway around here and then if someone is about to enter your base you can just shoot it and just keep moving around so that they won't hit you back so i actually found out a glitch where it can be invisible for an infinite amount of time so i'm gonna be posting that after this video so if you guys want to watch that uh, you can go to the description down below and i'm gonna be posting a link over there to show you guys so the a new thing that they added in this update was the emotes. So they now replace the sprays. Uh, now, so the emotes now replace the sprays because you don't won't really want to spray something while you're in the game. So now they added this new emote thing where you will show your enemies your spray. I don't know. You can just do this when you're about to fight or something like that. So now let's head into a real game and see if this smoke bomb is re really that invisible. Alright guys, so the only weakness for this kit is that uh, you can't inter interact with the map while you're invisible. 
So you need to wait until your invisibility is gone before you can actually you uh, start mining the blocks. So well, I'm just gonna quickly get another invisible uh, or the smoke bomb, and I'm gonna show you how you can destroy a bit from there. Alright, guys. So what you need to make sure is that you have some blocks and also the smoke kit. So what you need to do, I think this is a bit risky, is that you need to come over here and place a block down here and then you need to block clutch. That's what you need to do. So once you have block clutch, then you can uh, mine the bait from there. Because you can just extend your view and you can destroy the bait from underneath their base. Alright guys, so unfortunately our bait got destroyed before I can destroy their bait. But that is actually how you want to destroy someone's bait when you have the smoke kit. So you basically need to block clutch at the side of their base and then extend your POV and then you can destroy the bait from there. Alright guys, so overall I think this kit is pretty OP if you know how to use it. So the only weakness is that you can't actually interact with the map while you have the smoke bomb on but the good thing about this kit is that you can actually go invisible and you can easily destroy bait when you have this kit. So that is it for the video, if you did enjoy the video, please remember to smash that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell if you want to watch more videos like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.